All right, I'm gonna take the inside of this. I think you'll enjoy this. If you like the cowboy way of life, I think you'll enjoy it. Okay. Take a little bit of slow time here. Bring in here. You okay, got a couch, makes into a bed. And a dinette, makes into a bed. That's a really pretty flooring in this in this unit as well. And you got a fireplace on the left. Okay. I'm gonna back up here. And as you walk in the door, you got a banister, a real nice banister, some really deep steps. Okay, and take you in here. Okay, on your right hand side, you're gonna have soft touch walls. All that means is a dirt and mud, you can wipe it off with a sponge. And then you can see how big the crown molding is. Okay, you can see we covered our speakers with wood and our vents with wood and lots of storage over the top of the bed. And you'll notice this, this is um, a high gloss. This is an upgraded interior. Okay, 110 plug into the right side and I think let me see here. Yeah, 110 to the left side of the mattress as well. Okay, storage there. Come around here and more closet here. Okay, and I'm going to take you back here. More storage and access to your radio and to your DVD player. Okay, and I'm just going to back up here, kind of give you a visual. Okay, to the right side of the stove, you have a pantry high in a pantry low. Okay. And then storage here, or not storage, but dual stainless steel sink, recessed top for your stove, two burner. And then you also have a, a uh, convection microwave oven with storage above it. Okay. And then you got a, a, a good size flat screen television that'll fold out and you can watch from the bed either way you want to watch it. You got a couch that's going to make into a bed and this is soft touch uh, seating with gator on the back and I promise you there was no gator harmed in the making of this couch I'm sure of that okay you also have another one 110 plug in here you can see it or not but it's there okay now most of these these campers or trailers what you whatever you want to call them the water tank is underneath the couch of the dinette okay this is neither one. You got storage under the couch and storage under the dinette as well. Your water is on the outside underneath underneath the camper. Okay, here's something else I want to show you. All the furniture you can see here is dovetailed together. None of this is just steepled together. Slide that back. Slide that back. Okay, you can see here where the gator's inset. It's not wrapped. It's inset. It's inset here as well. A lot of detail on, on this. Okay, I'll give you a visual shot of this. Back up here where you can see it. Back up here and sit on the edge of the bed here. Okay. Swing this thing around here slowly. There's your couch, dinette, your big fridge. Bring it over here. This is a, a what they call petrified wood countertop, which has been very popular. You also have a cowboy hat rack over the top of the door. And notice there's no vinyl wrap in this in this trailer at all. Everything in here is solid alder. Solid alder. Now I've got the fireplace on, it's a little cool outside. It's nice and toasty in here. And I have a lot of people say, oh Rick, uh, uh, fireplace is too much. But really guys, it's not. It's not, a, it's not a high dollar upgrade. And if you get out and have your camper, you know, you're out someplace and run out of propane, or your fireplace breaks down, or you're paying the people already for a, uh, you're plugged into their 110 or whatever you're doing, Run off third dime. Run off third dime. Shut your furnace down. Now what I'm doing, I'm sitting here on the couch. 
and this is this is your view this is your view from the couch very nice very nice spin around here I mean you can sit here I'll move over here closer to the door a little closer to the fireplace again I'll give you a view of that okay you can sit here and have a conversation with whoever you want to have a conversation with everybody's comfortable okay give you this view again I hope I'm not overdoing it I just want to give you the feeling of it okay now up here underneath this wood and this screen is a plastic cover that you see in almost all the campers well this is again this is a upgraded with with that package all the vents and speakers are covered with with the wood okay I'm gonna get up here you got soft shades and you got soft shades on all the windows here and then soft shades up into the bedroom I forgot to mention that so I'm bringing that back to your attention I tend to move these fast so I'll try to slow down here for you okay there's your pantry again now notice you don't have a swinging door here this has got what's called a pocket door I'll walk into the bathroom kind of show you from that angle that door slides over in the corner so it takes up no room it has a locker there okay now you got dual mirrors over over your really nice vanity lighting above that okay you've got a really nice shower in here it's a frosted shower so you don't have to worry about all the water spotting and there's where your furnace is ducked in there okay I want to step back in here we'll talk about this this power fan above you okay you can set this at whatever degrees you want to set this on and your speed and up and down it's a rain sensor as well so if you want to uh, if you got it open and it starts raining rain sensor should shut it off and close its own self okay now I'm going to talk, turn around here where you can actually see the closet okay big closet and it's as big as it looks I'll open it up so you can see hang closet shelf another hang closet a lot of people call it a walk-in closet. I don't know. It, I don't know that you call it a walk-in closet. It's got the tweed on the walls, which is really nice. Okay, close that up. You can see the real nice chair rail, even in the bathroom. They, they just, you know, a lot of detail in here. Just a lot of quality in here. You can see how big that vanity is. It's nice. Okay, I'm gonna give you a look. See from this side. And you can see the nice high gloss. You know, everything's covered with wood. There's no vinyl on this camper at all. You know, a lot of them, if you want maple, they put a maple sticker on. If you want hickory, they put a hickory sticker on it. Not so with uh, with Murhow. When Murhow says it's maple, it's maple. If they say it's Aldridge, it's Aldridge. And that's what this is. Okay, so swinging around here again. okay let's see let's talk about your your control board okay you have a power awning here push button slide this is your this trailer is equipped with a generator so it starts stops right here exterior lights interior lights uh, your water pump your water heater okay this is for your gas your electric it's all set up here You know, if you've been waiting for a quality trailer, guys, this this is it. This is it, and they're not price crazy. That's that's the whole thing. That's the whole thing about. Uh, come give you a little bit of light up here. That's the whole thing about uh, Murhow. They're built as good as anything that I have ever sold, and I've sold some of the big names, but they're not priced as goofy as some of these guys are you know most of the time I can sell this and a new truck to pull it with for what these other guys are just selling their trailers for well I think I've shown you about everything I can show you give you one more look see here see how big that crown molding is runs all the way around lots of storage lots of storage 
Got your scotch lights up there. Got controls for those too. You also got a switch here. So you can control it from here or, for, or from the bed, either one. And again, more storage up here at the foot of your bed. I don't know what else a person could have that would be any nicer than what this is, to be honest with you guys. Um, well, I think I've got, I think that's it. If I've missed anything, give us a call, 573-885-6300. 573-885-6300 um, go on the web at cowtownusainc.com cowtownusainc.com or watch our new television show on uh, RFD comes on uh, Tuesday nights in, at 8.30 central time um, it's called Women's Pro Rodeo Today in uh, Watch, be watched for Stevie Hillman on that show, and keep an eye on uh, Billy Jack Sabian. Billy Jack's come on with us too, and, and uh, he'll be in a, a Murhow trailer. Uh, so if you get a chance, visit with either one of those folks. I'm sure they'll be glad to answer questions or get you hooked up with us, or or what you know you might want to look at their trailers and see what you see what you think about there. Uh, I think that's about all I got to say about that, but there's a view from the couch. It sure makes you feel good. Thank you.